How does that make you feel? Terrible. Terrible? Yeah. I've been vegan for five years. You're, you're vegan? Yeah. Yeah. What about your friend? My girlfriend's been vegan too, yeah. yeah. Nice. How long? Uh, no, not as, like, I, I cheat a little bit, but yeah, I try. Yeah. You cheat? A little bit. Like, <laughs> like cookies and stuff, save milk, but yeah. Mm -hmm. She's a better vegan than me, but yeah. So, veganism is not a diet, so you would cheat on a diet. Or when you do vegan or plant-based diet for environmental aspects, you may cheat. But veganism is an, is an idea that you don't consume animals and they're not for us, for our pleasure, right? So it's, it's not a gray zone that you can be 99% vegan. It sounds like you have all the good intentions. But if you really compare that to any other form of oppression, you know, you wouldn't accept um, just for, for, for one second. Yeah. If I did something like racist and I said like, oh, I'm, I'm just cheating on not being racist, would you accept that as an excuse to no. me, right? Yeah, that makes so sense. Please, yeah, please. I'm so cheating <laughs> being vegan, so. <laughs> so please, you know, consider yeah. the same thing for these, these animals. So remember, every time that you don't reject animal products, you, you are basically saying that this is okay. You, you know the truth about dairy right? and egg, right? So if you really remember that, I understand sometimes it might seem difficult, yeah. but let me ask you this, do you think it's harder for you to be vegan or do you think it's harder for that cow to go through that or do you think it's harder for the egg, uh, for, the, for the chicken to, yeah, to go through Of course. Right? Yeah. So please treat the issue just with that seriousness um, and we want to be clear that this is not food for thought, right? Mm -hmm. It's not a gray zone, it's black and white. You're either contributing to this or not.